Physicists claim that the universe began around 13.7 billion years ago following an event known as the Big Bang. However, the real question is, what triggered this explosion and what was the reason behind it? Over time, researchers have delved into the science and history of our universe. The Big Bang has stood as the leading explanation for the phenomena we've observed. Many studies have been conducted with thousands of scientists contributing and the data consistently supports the Big Bang theory as the primary model for the universe's formation. According to this theory, a type of energy known as dark energy more abundant than the energy found in galaxies is seen as the force of anti-gravity that drives the universe's ongoing expansion since the Big Bang. Modern science has evolved significantly from earlier times, and with the progress of technology, new theories are always emerging. Often, we find that things we once thought to be absolutely true are far from it. Physicist Myoaku has officially questioned the Big Bang theory. This skepticism arises because the James Webb Telescope has discovered 750 new galaxies that look radically different from predictions made by scientists. This discovery brings forth new perspectives, prompting a deeper investigation into how the James Webb Telescope is altering our understanding of the universe. Join us on this remarkable journey as we explore the farthest reaches of the observable universe and uncover more about these newly found galaxies. If you're keen on staying updated with the most recent cosmic news, sign up for our channel, give this video a like, share it to spread the word, and activate the notification bell. The images of the new galaxies taken by the James Webb Telescope are absolutely breathtaking. But what does it mean to go beyond the observable universe? A single frame shows hundreds of galaxies, each more stunning than the last. These photographs are powerful and beautiful, leaving a lasting impression. However, what might surprise most people is the exact opposite of what was expected. For scientists, these images are astonishing, but they don't align with the anticipated results based on existing theories. In fact, there are more galaxies than expected, and these galaxies differ from the norm. They are smaller than anticipated, and their ages are remarkably old. This unexpected discovery caused some concern among scientists, with one article even starting with the word panic to highlight the gravity of the circumstance. These newly discovered galaxies don't match what was predicted by established theories. For many years, the density of this point was so extreme that it held an immense amount of mass and energy within an incredibly small space, subjected to extreme pressure and density. Under these conditions, temperatures were unimaginable, exceeding any known temperatures. The energy contained in this dense, hot point is thought to have been the origin of the universe itself, establishing the foundation of everything in our cosmos. After the singularity, the universe began to expand, setting into motion the process of cosmic inflation, which took place over roughly 13.7 billion years, ultimately forming the universe as we know it. The universe initially expanded with incredible speed during the period of cosmic inflation, faster than the speed of light. It was as though the fabric of space itself stretched, pulling everything within it. This phase was crucial to shaping the large-scale structure of the universe, smoothing out irregularities, creating a more even distribution of energy and matter, and setting the stage for the formation of galaxies, stars, and other cosmic structures. As the universe continued to expand, the rate of expansion gradually slowed despite the rapid inflation that occurred in the early stages. The universe grew at a steady rate following that, referred to as cosmic expansion. Scientists have observed the consequences of this expansion, including the redshift of light from distant galaxies. Redshift indicates that as the universe expands, the light waves from faraway galaxies stretch, shifting toward the red end of the spectrum. During the expansion, all the universe's material makeup was initially compressed into a small space. It was evident that matter couldn't remain in such a tightly packed area, so transformations began. As the universe cooled and expanded, particles like protons, neutrons, and electrons began interacting with the environment around them, including light and energy. 
These interactions were crucial in the formation of matter during the universe's initial few minutes following the Big Bang, a process known as nucleosynthesis. Initially, chaotic and irregular galaxies were expected due to frequent collisions. However, the galaxies captured by the James Webb Telescope tell a different story. Instead of seeing chaotic galaxies, the images reveal well-organized spiral and disk-like structures similar to those observed in our universe today. This unexpected finding questions the idea that mergers play an important role in galaxy evolution. If these galaxies haven't appeared to have undergone numerous mergers, it is unlikely that small galaxies would grow to expand by hundreds of times, as was previously expected. This challenges the notion that galaxies expand by a fusion process. Moreover, the optical illusion suggested by the expanding universe theory, where objects appear smaller because of the expansion, does not seem to apply in this case. As a result, what we thought we knew about the universe is now in doubt. Additionally, the quantity and age of the galaxies discovered by the James Webb Space Telescope further challenge the truth about the Big Bang Theory. The James Webb Telescope includes IR filters that make it possible to study distant galaxies by analyzing their color. By examining these hues, astronomers can estimate the age of the galaxies and their stars. If you liked this video, please do not forget to hit the like button, share it to reach a wider audience, and subscribe to our channel so that you can keep up with our future content. The findings from the James Webb Telescope continue to generate a great deal of discussion and the community of scientists is uncertain. The unexpected discovery of these ancient, small, and smooth galaxies presents new challenges to our previous understanding of the universe's origins. As more data comes in, scientists are being forced to reconsider many of the foundational ideas that have shaped our understanding of cosmology for decades. A result of these brand new observations is a reconsideration of the origins of galaxies that originated in the earliest universe. The traditional Big Bang theory suggested that galaxies formed through a series of mergers, with smaller galaxies crashing together to form larger structures over time. However, the images provided through the James Webb Telescope show galaxies that appear to have formed in ways that do not fit this narrative. The smoothness and size of the galaxies in the telescope's images contradict the idea that they should have undergone many mergers or collisions. In addition, the unexpected age of these galaxies further complicates the situation, forcing scientists to re-evaluate the timeline for the formation of galaxies and the processes by which they evolved. Another important aspect of this re-evaluation is the number of galaxies discovered by the James Webb Telescope. The conventional theory of the expanding universe, regarded as the universe, suggests that as they expand, galaxies should increasingly spread out. However, the Big Bang theory has been the most widely accepted explanation for the origins of our vast universe. According to this model, the universe began roughly 13.7 billion years ago after some mysterious cosmic event. However, these new images are challenging the previously accepted narrative about the birth of the cosmos. The photos captured by the James Webb Telescope challenge the discovery of 750 galaxies and the current understanding of the universe's origins. Specifically, these images directly contradict the Big Bang hypothesis, which has long been viewed as an unquestionable truth by cosmologists. The galaxies shown in the images appear to be significantly smaller, smoother, older, and more numerous than what was predicted by the Big Bang theory. Notably, these galaxies are two to three times smaller than those observed by the Hubble Space Telescope, which defies the expectation of an expanding universe. According to the Big Bang model, as the universe expands, galaxies should appear larger as they move farther away. Yet, the new web images show galaxies that challenge this supposition. Additionally, the smoothness of these galaxies contrasts with predictions made by the Big Bang theory. According to this model, galaxies should exhibit irregularities and structural variations as a result of their formation and evolution. 
However, the web images reveal galaxies that are unusually smooth and lack the complexity and roughness one would typically anticipate finding in galaxies of this age. This observation contradicts the expected timeline for galaxy formation and evolution as proposed by the Big Bang Theory. At the universe's inception, all matter, energy, and the building blocks of existence were packed into an incredibly dense point called a singularity. Within this singularity, the density was infinitely high due to the extreme compression of matter and energy. The concept of the singularity is grounded in our current understanding of physics, especially Einstein's equations of general relativity. In this singularity, all matter and energy existed in an extraordinarily compressed state. The James Webb images show an unusually high quantity of galaxies grouped together in some areas, which contrasts with expectations based on the Big Bang model. This observation raises important questions about the true nature of the expansion of the universe and whether our current models are sufficiently comprehensive to explain all the discovered phenomena. As the field of cosmology continues to evolve, the discovery of these unexpected galaxies may mark a turning point in our understanding of the universe. It suggests that we may be on the cusp of a new era in scientific exploration, where our current hypotheses regarding the Big Bang and the origins of the universe are subjected to intense scrutiny and revision. This is a testament to the dynamic nature of science, where new evidence and observations often lead to paradigm shifts in how we perceive the cosmos. In the years to come, as more data are gathered from the James Webb Space Telescope and other cutting-edge instruments, our comprehension of the universe's birth and evolution will continue to grow and evolve. It is possible that the answers we seek may challenge the very foundations of the Big Bang Theory and force us to reconsider the entire framework of cosmology. Even though these findings raise more questions than answers, they also provide a glimpse into the incredible mystery and complexity of the universe that remains to be uncovered. Right now, the scientific community remains divided on how to use the data, with some scientists firmly adhering to the Big Bang Theory, whereas others are looking into alternative models of cosmic origins. This debate is likely to continue for many years to come as new evidence and observations are integrated into our understanding of the cosmos. However, one thing is certain, the James Webb Telescope has opened up new avenues of inquiry that will undoubtedly reshape our perspective on the universe and its beginnings for future generations. As we move further into the exploration of the universe's early stages, the revelations from the James Webb Telescope's findings have sparked a larger conversation about the validity of the Big Bang Theory. Traditionally, this theory has been seen as the bedrock explanation for how the universe began. But the new findings are forcing scientists to ask difficult questions regarding the theory's accuracy. These observations point to the possibility that we may be looking at a much more complex and varied cosmic history than previously thought. What is becoming increasingly clear is that the understanding of the universe's beginnings is far from settled. The images captured by the Webb Telescope have illuminated new dimensions of the universe that were previously unknown to us. By pushing the boundaries of our observational tools, scientists are now discovering galaxies that appear to be far older, smaller, and more uniform than anticipated, challenging the notion that the universe followed a gradual and predetermined process of evolution. If these galaxies were indeed formed in the early universe, their underlying structure and age contradict the expected cosmic timeline established by the Big Bang Theory. This has led to speculation that the universe may have undergone a different set of processes, ones that could involve more complex interactions than the simple expansion suggested by traditional models. The idea that it is possible for galaxies to form so smoothly and at such a size at the beginning of the universe suggests that perhaps other forces or processes were at work, ones that we haven't yet fully identified.